Welcome to our channel. In today's video, we'll be discussing how to install proprietary drivers in Ubuntu 22.04 LTS. Proprietary drivers can improve the performance and compatibility of your hardware, so let's get started. Ubuntu typically recommends open source drivers by default. However, if proprietary drivers are available for your hardware, they may offer better performance or additional features. First, let's open the terminal. It's always a good idea to update your system first. In the terminal, we'll use the Ubuntu drivers command to manage and install drivers. To see the available drivers for your hardware, type the following command and press enter. This command will list the available proprietary driver packages that are available. Since I'm on a virtual machine it will just show a few drivers. Otherwise you might see a list like this if for example you have a NVIDIA graphic card installed. If you want to install drivers automatically, you can run the following command which will install the best match drivers. The command is used to install proprietary drivers in Ubuntu. The command automatically handles the process of downloading the driver package from the repository and installing it on your system, saving you from manually finding and installing the drivers. To install a specific driver, you can use the install command followed by the driver name. So, when you run the command sudo ubuntu drivers install driver name, you are instructing Ubuntu to download and install the driver specified by driver name. The driver name should be replaced with the actual name of the driver you want to install, such as NVIDIA driver for NVIDIA graphics card drivers. You can also install proprietary drivers in Ubuntu 22.04 LTS using the graphical user interface. Type software and updates in the search bar and click on the corresponding application. I'm on a virtual machine, but if you have a NVIDIA graphics card installed on your machine for example drivers will appear like this. If proprietary drivers are available for your hardware, they may offer better performance or additional features. Select a proprietary driver. After selecting the driver, click on the Apply Changes button at the bottom right corner of the window. Ubuntu will prompt you to enter your password for authentication. Enter your password and click Authenticate. Now, Ubuntu will download and install the selected driver. The installation process may take some time, depending on the size of the driver and your internet connection speed. That's it for today's video. We hope this tutorial was helpful to you. If you have any questions or suggestions, please let us know in the comments below. Don't forget to like this video and subscribe to our channel for more Ubuntu tutorials. Thank you for watching, and we'll see you in the next one.